Hello everyone, Horse Crazy back finally with a new Minecraft video. It might not be the kind of mod that all you guys are gonna like, but naturally, this mod it's quickly becoming one of my favorites. So as you can see beside me, there is a horse. Now, this is not the regular Minecraft Mo Creatures horse. If I can just switch back here. Oh, hello, Mr. Village Man. Ignore him. Okay. So, this mod is called Simply Horses. Um, the links and all that will be below. It has one of the simplest mod installations ever, which I will show you guys later as well. So, obviously, this game, or this mod, adds horses. But not just any horses you actually get a total of four different types of horses and several different colors many different colors but the colors don't show up unless you have a specific texture pack that can be found on the forum page so first of all you will need to craft a few items so build myself a crafting bench okay so i got myself a crafting bench I'm going to just place it down. Oops. Uh, right there. Okay. I'm also going to put my diamond armor on, and I will explain that later. Obviously, for this particular video, I have used too many items to cheat my way into some of these items. You will also see why later. So. To start off with, you will need a lasso. String goes there, and there, I believe, and there, and there. And iron goes smack dab in the middle. And you get a lasso, or a lasso, or whatever you want to call it. A rope. So, you'll need one of those. Let me move my pork chops. You will also need multiple saddles, which I already have some made here. So, oops. There, there, and these saddles become removable. So, like that, and like that, and that there is your saddle. Pretty sure it's just the regular pig saddle. That will work. And then, you will need either a Clydesdale yoke, a Mustang bridle, or Arabian shoes to get the different breeds of horses. So to make the bridle, you start with a leather cap, and then three iron along the bottom, and you get a Mustang bridle, which I'm just gonna give myself a bunch, because I'll need them later. And then you will need a Clydesdale yoke, if you want some Clydesdale horses, so two wood in the middle, and iron like that gives you a Clydesdale yoke. And I'm only going to need one of those because I don't want another Clydesdale. And Arabian shoes is simply an upside down iron bucket. And I actually want quite a few of those. Alright. And that is pretty much all you need for this mod. Oh, you also need some sugar. There's my sugar. There it is. And you just plop that smack dab in the middle and you get sugar cubes. And I definitely do not need that many. Sugar cubes will be used for breeding later on in the mod. This mod is still in alpha release phase. So there are still some bugs occasionally. And there are still some stuff to be worked out. I'm going to zap it to daytime. I also have mo creatures installed still. So if you see other animals, do not panic. They are not actually part of this mod. Okay, so take your lasso. Go find yourself some horses. They only spawn um, so far in the plains. And I'm in survival mode, so these things are going to come after me. I guess I could have just turned my creatures off, but I didn't want to. Okay, we will explain that fenced in water later. Where did my herd of horses go? There's one over here. Okay. 
So you take your lasso. And there's actually a piece of fence over there. So. Oh. He is a stallion. So I'm going to run away. So what happened there is that horse is a stallion. And because of its color right now, I couldn't tell. Oh, there's more horses over there. Perfect. So horses that have a white spot on their forehead, like this one. I don't want to get too close. Is a stallion. If you get too close to them, they will attack you like it did to me. And it will throw you and kick you and probably bite you, I guess. And cause you bodily harm. So, the best idea is to go after a herd of horses. And lasso one of the mares before the stallion finds you. And I'm pretty sure the stallion's the black one there. So I actually want to go after that gray one in the background, if I can, without getting attacked. Oh, I spooked them. Okay. If you spook the herd, the stallion will actually lead... Oh, I don't like you. Okay, so I got one. You take your lasso and you right-click on one of the horses. And then it will obviously follow you around. Because you technically have it attached to a rope. Now, when you originally lasso the horse, um, there's supposed to be like little particles, black particles coming off of them. I don't know if it's not working because of a bug or if it's something I did. So you right click on your horse, then you right click on the fence, and it pretty much ties them invisibly to that fence. So they will stay within a certain area of that fence. So there's multiple ways you can tame them. You can walk away and wait two whole Minecraft days, or you can feed them food. You can feed them apples, wheat, um, sugar cubes, but you obviously need quite a few of those. Or you can feed them cake, and it only takes eight, eight cake to fully tame a horse. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And they magically change color due to this texture pack. If you don't have this texture pack, you'll just get a bunch of horses that look the same. So it goes from wild horse, which that one was, to Mustang. So you can take a saddle and you right click on them to put the saddle on right click to take the saddle off shift hit shift and right click like so to get on the horse's back shift and right click on the horse to get off so he's still tied to the fence so i can either keep him like that oh he's not tied to the fence anymore come back i can either keep him like I can either keep him like that, or I can give him a breed, because he's still technically a wild horse. So, I can either take my Mustang bridle and turn him into a Mustang, give him Arabian shoes, and he'll become an Arabian, or give him the Clydesdale yoke, and he'll become a Clydesdale. So I'm actually going to give him the Clydesdale yoke. It makes the saddle disappear, because you can't actually ride the Clydesdales. And you get this cool Clydesdale horse. So I'm going to take him back oops, to the farm, if I can, there we go, slight computer glitch. My computer's been on the fritz for the past couple days, I've had to take it in and get it looked at, and it's on the verge of being fixed, so forgive me for any glitches and very bad quality videos. Oh, also, when they're attached to your lasso, they uh, teleport. So, I'm going to take him in here, I'm going to right click him on that fence, and then I'm going to get rid of a couple pieces of fence here, so I can push him in there with the other Clydesdale, because he's tied to that fence post, so he won't go anywhere once I get him in there. Me. Get in there. Okay. So with the texture pack, you will get different colors of horses. So these two are Clydesdales. They like cats, and I will explain that to you later. You can't ride them. They like cats. Eventually, there will be a craftable cart that you can pull around with them that can hold a chest or something. 
All of these horses over here are the Mustangs. So they were given the Mustang bridle, which is this one. And you just right click on them and it turns them into a Mustang. Once you give them a Mustang bridle or Arabian shoes or Clydesdale yoke, you can never change them back. They will stay that breed forever. Okay. And then this Arabian here, uh, they can go really fast, but they hate creepers. And we will look at that later. Mustangs can't go that fast, but they like combat. And that comes in very handy in a second. Okay. Alrighty, so I have waited. I actually waited. I could have just used too many items to change it to nighttime, but I waited till nighttime. Okay, so it's nighttime. I'm gonna take my little Arabian horsey out for a ride. I'm gonna jump this fence. We're gonna go out. Oh, come on. There we go. And we're just gonna ride around. So when you sprint with an Arabian, they go really fast. Like faster than, definitely faster ground you can cover than by yourself. But when you go towards a creeper, and I'm going to change modes here. When you go towards a creeper, they will buck you off and run away. Because they don't like creepers. They're scared of creepers. And he just runs away. So technically that's... And then the creeper's also coming after me. Because I'm... I'm on survival mode. So I'm going to run away. Away from that creeper. <laughs> Get on my horse. And I'm going to put him back. Put him back in here. Okay. And then I'm going to tie him to the fence. And then I need to get out of here myself somehow. Didn't quite think this through. Okay. Alright. And like I said, the Mustangs like combat. So I'm going to go and pick a Mustang here. I'm going to take the gray one. Okay, we're going to run out of here. And watch this. So they don't sprint quite as fast, but you can destroy. Whoops. The mobs just. What it means by it likes combat is if you time it right, you can just charge right through mobs like that, and it will cause them bodily harm. It also hurts you a little bit, but I wouldn't be too worried about that. Ow. <laughs> You're healable. But your horses also incur damage too, so there are several whoa, he's going really fast. Oh wow, he kicked Okay. So that's enough of that. Oh he's he's doing this on on his own. Wow. He does like combat. <laughs> Okay, so if your horse reaches zero with his health bar, and I'm going to change it to daytime because this is just nuts. And he's totally running after them on his own. I'm not even touching the keyboard. That could be troublesome. Okay, so now that they're out of my way, let me get back in here. Okay, so that's enough of that. That was just nuts. So you see how his head is lower than all these ones? That's because he incurred some damage. When their health reaches zero, they die, like other mobs. So you want to take care of them. Oh, I just gave him one cake and it fixed him right up. Okay. So you feed them food. I'm not sure if the Arabian incurred some damage or not, but I'll give him a cake anyway. So you want to take care of them by feeding them. So obviously he really likes combat. And I'm going to go hunt for an ocelot now, or better yet, I can just spawn one. 
And that means I'm going to need some raw fish too. Okay, so I'll spawn an ocelot. Okay, I turned it into a tame cat. You can take your lasso and right click on the cat. And you go to your Clydesdales, who apparently love cats. Come on now. And you can right click on them with the lasso. Or at least this is supposed to work. Right click on the cat. And the cat will sit on the Clydesdale. It's kind of hard to see. But the kitty is now on the Clydesdale. So far, that besides the look of a Clydesdale, that is the only thing the Clydesdales can do in this mod so far. Um, there will be other stuff eventually included. So I'm going to leave him there like that. And what else was I going to say? Oh yeah, when you go into a herd of horses. Like say I go and... Go back to that herd of horses that was over here. Ah! You're coming with me. Well, that's... That's fine. I forgot you were still attached to the lasso. So, if you have another horse near you that's already tamed, it's a lot easier, especially if you're riding them, to go into a herd of horses without the stallion attacking you. So I'm going to go over here and I'm gonna take the black one just because I really want a black horse. So I'm gonna lasso him. Oh the stallion still got me. That's mean. <laughs> okay, this isn't going well. Maybe it's only when you actually ride the horse. Fine, I'll take you, silly stallion. I'll take you. And I'll take the black one, if I can. There we go. And I will take all of you back. Since you all seem to want to come with me. Oh, I only got the stallion. Okay, that works too. So I lied about that. It's only when you're riding the horse. I thought if you had a Cladsdale and a cat with you, it might work too. But I guess not. You can also tie other horses to horses. So I would have already had that Clydesdale on on the lasso. So by right clicking on that stallion, it pretty much just tied the Clydesdale to the stallion. So I'm going to take you guys and tie you to that fence post. And take you and get rid of that cat. And tie you to that fence post. And I'm going to feed this stallion some cake. Maybe eat a cake myself, because I'm... There we go. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, wow, he went from brown to... Okay, put a saddle on you. Um, and I'll give you a Mustang bridle. Do I have a white one yet? Nope, just a cream-colored one. Alright! So as you can see, this, of course, this mod would be very near and dear to my heart. Links will be posted below. This is pretty much all I can say just yet about the mod. Lots of stuff that the girl that made this mod is planning to do. She wants to add carts that the Clydesdales can pull to make them a little more useful. I'm not sure if there's breeding yet. There could be. Let's try that. You're supposed to be able to take these sugar cubes and feed them to some horses. I'll give you one, and I'll give you one. Oh, okay, yep, yeah. and you can breed a foal. Oh, there we go. <laughs> it's like inside its mother. There we go. He will always stay with his mother. It doesn't matter if you can't lasso him to the fence, but he will stay because his mom's here. And foals take two... Two Minecraft days to grow, and there's currently nothing you can do to speed them up that I have noticed. And I'm pretty sure... Bam. Bam. You can only breed Mustangs, apparently. Alright, so that is it. The mod is called Simply Horses. 
Eventually, it'll be called Complex. Complexly? I don't know how she pronounces it, but it'll be uh, Complex Horses. That's what the mod's gonna be called. And that's just gonna be when it's completely finished and in beta. Currently, it's in alpha. Please make sure you download 2.4. That's the newest release. Other ones, they'll work, but there's still some bugs that are there. So, I will see you guys with the next video. Hopefully, this video isn't crappy quality. Catch you later. Horse Crazy, signing off.